lot of veterans face the same challenges that I did uh, when I got out of the military. I had uh, six years of service in the military, but I didn't really have any hard skills that, that I had learned in the military that would qualify me for many jobs. There aren't too many companies out there looking for former tank commanders uh, to do something in the civilian world. I think veterans are a great fit in multifamily. Um, the military focuses on a lot of the same things that we focus on in multifamily. Um, the military has a very heavy em emphasis on training, uh, which is also a, a big deal here in multifamily. Um, there's a lot of focus on, obviously in the military, working within the, the team framework. And again, that's, that's what we do here in multifamily as well. We all work in teams, whether it's out on site at the property or whether that's the home office team. Um, so a lot of those same things that you've, a lot of those same soft skills that you've applied in the military are the same soft skills that you can apply in multifamily. While multifamily, I think, is certainly becoming more focused on um, having people enter the market uh, with some of those hard skills, you know, you see property management degrees out there now, um, and, and you see a, a need for more highly skilled maintenance workers. Um, I still think that um, people from the military can get into multifamily without all of those hard skills and probably be pretty well positioned to, to learn quickly. A military veteran is, is an ideal employee because you kind of know what you're getting. Um, if somebody's been in the military and been honorably discharged, you know that they've, they've spent however many years they were in the military with a high level of accountability, a, a lot of exposure to um, team situations, um, there's a lot of focus on leadership. So I think you, ha you have somebody um, as an employer uh, that you hire from the military and you know that they're going to be good at all those things. So the, the hard skills you may have to train them, you may have a little bit more um, room to make up, uh, but I think you can be very confident that you're getting a quality individual uh, who's going to be ready and willing to learn.